Hi, I'm Erin Burt, and today I want to focus on the issue of a spouse concealing or hiding assets during an Illinois divorce. Now, during the breakdown of a marriage, it's very common for there to be a mistrust or anger, hurt emotions. Sometimes one spouse is already preparing for a divorce, and they might feel that it's very clever to try to hide assets or to transfer assets in an attempt to reduce their marital estate. So what are some of the common things that people do during a divorce that we need to be aware of? Well, a lot of times people will do what I said earlier. They'll transfer funds to a third party, meaning they might give their mom or a relative funds to hold on their behalf, thinking that the court will never be able to find them or access them. Other times people will make up liabilities. Maybe they'll make up a promissory note or they'll make up a debt and say that a significant amount of their assets or income went to paying off that debt. Sometimes they just claim an asset's been disposed of and they will try to say that that asset was sold a long time ago and the money was spent for marital expenses. And then a lot of times people just lie. I know that's hard to believe, but they'll just lie and they will just deny that there is any type of asset or any interest in an asset. But there are ways that we can uncover that. In litigation, we've got the discovery process, but commonly we will take a look at tax returns or we'll take a, take a look at financial documents to see if there are income producing assets, if there are assets being disclosed or claimed. So some tips that I have for you. When you think that you either want a divorce or that your family might be experiencing a divorce in the near future, I suggest you gather up all of your financial documents that you can before you come meet with me to discuss your divorce. I also suggest that you bring about three years of tax returns with you. Schedule A, B, C, D, and E will give us a lot of clues as to what your marital estate truly looks like. So if you need somebody to take a look at all of your financial documents and you need to discuss further whether there are any hidden assets in your marriage that will be subject to your divorce, please contact me so that we can get a head start on looking at all of your information and help you discover what truly your marital estate looks like.